Will the propaganda for this voice never stop? Latest example, an investigation by the Australian newspaper found that school children around the country are now being indoctrinated to support Labor's plan for the voice, that Aboriginal only kind of parliament. Victoria's, of course, worse than Education Department spokesman said, students have conversations about the voice at school because it's important for understanding Victoria's own journey to a treaty. They want students to also back a treaty with Aborigines, just like the separate nation. It's government propaganda. I have no doubt that both sides will be discussed, um, but certainly the government it is making it clear that we are supportive um, of a voice to parliament. New South Wales is not pushing it as hard as Victoria, but still, the Shearwater Mullumbimby uh, Steiner School, Steiner School warning, says students there can now recite the Uluru Statement by heart. And St Andrews Cathedral School shows students videos from ABC journalist Stan Grant, a real race warrior there.